there is a better way to manage requests and internal workflows. In this video, I'm going to show you how to build a smart lightweight business app using Zite and fill out to do just that, complete with conditional logic, routing, and able to connect to the tools you already use to manage your data all in under 10 minutes. Hey there, I'm Alex Knowles from automationhelpers.com and we help companies get set up and automated using industry leading portals, apps, and integrations. Today, we're going to see just how easy it is to build a business app to help you in your internal workflows using fill out to capture data and Zite, which is an AI powered app builder to turn that data into an interactive, useful interface. We will route submissions through automated workflows and update tools like Airtable, Google Sheets, or your CRM. And we'll even trigger post events to occur like generating a document or sending a reminder email. Fillout gives us the interaction layer, the forms, scheduling tools, and request capture experience that feels clean, custom, and on brand. It's where your users enter data, make selections, and trigger workflows. Unlike other competitors, Fillout gives you deeper integrations, complex automated workflows, and has an app builder built in, which is Zite. Zite will give us the full app interface. It's an AI powered builder that lets us turn those interactions into a real working app with pages, views, logic, and layouts all created simply by describing what we need. Together, Zite and Fillout form the front end of your smart business app a business app that seamlessly connects to your backend tool. If you want to learn more about Zite, then make sure to watch the video linked in the description of this video, or if you're eager to learn more about the form building tool, fill out, check out our fill out playlist. But in this video, we want to take a look at how we can use Zite and fill out to build a beautiful and interactive internal job tracking dashboard like this one here. We can see the job requests I've submitted personally, the submit request page, where we'll open currently a form that was created through Zype, but we'll check out how to bring in fill outs, as well as all the requests that we currently have and the team directory of our team members who are involved. Now we can sign out and if I log into jamiereadatcompany.com, we'll be able to see the job requests from them. If we take a look at spreadsheet, it's here that we can see how things get messy. Currently, this isn't as chaotic as what I've seen within Teams, but it's a place to manage those job requests, even the tasks related and the team members. The problem here is though, everyone's gonna be jumping in and adding new rows as opposed to a systemized request workflow. So here we are in Fillout, where we're able to build beautiful and customized forms, surveys, and scheduling tools. Here we've got a job request form, asking for information about the submitter, the job request, and so on. We've integrated that with our Google Sheet that we took a look at, which will update every time this form gets submitted. And we also have automated workflows that are triggered to occur when the form is submitted, whether accessed directly through the link or through the embed on the tracking dashboard. Here, we've got a confirmation email that is sent to me to notify me someone has submitted a job request. And we've also got the approve and assign task workflow. Here, the form is submitted and one of our team members are then asked to actually approve this request. And if it is approved, well, the right people are notified in Slack. And then we'll also want to send a notification to those team members who are involved in that request. Beyond this, we can also integrate this with your data management tool, whether that be Google Sheets or Airtable. And you can also directly access Zapier, Make, and other automation platforms from Fillout. But let's take a look at Zite. And here we have the Zite editor. Now, previously, Zite.com was a separate platform from Fila, and it still somewhat is. However, you access the platform itself directly from your Fillout account. Here we can see we've got forms and scheduling, as well as app, websites, and portals. Super exciting, and it's not something that is offered by other competitors. Having your app builder directly within your form building platform. Now, we noticed on the dashboard that we have that old school basic form that we can complete for a submission, a submission of a request. We were asked for the request title, priority, request type, needed by, etc. Now, this is all well and good. However, with Fillout, we can do a bit more. We will notice in workflows here that we've got the workflows that were created through Zite, but if we want to create automated workflows using other tools like we saw in our internal job request form, which I mean integrations and workflows, well, we'll simply have to do that through the form builder. 
And when it comes to editing your app, well, it's pretty simple. You can broadly ask AI to make updates for you, requesting a change, or you can select the edit icon here and select any one of the elements that are on your dashboard or on your business app. If we jump into my requests here, let's say for instance, we actually want to include a submit request button directly within that view. So include, now in the prompt that I've written, I've actually asked to include a fill out form. So with Zype, because it is a sister platform of fill out, we can actually bring fill out forms in as a widget. So we'll simply select connect and then all we need to do is select the form from the options in the drop down. And just like that, the submit request button has been added and if we select it, this will open up a new tab and we can submit the job request form. Now we could actually jump back into edit and ask to embed the form directly in the dashboard rather than open up a new tab, but that's entirely up to you. Now, again, you might be wondering why we don't use a form built by the AI app. Well, that's because as we said earlier, the automated workflows we can have set up on the back end are so much more powerful directly through the fill out form builder. And it's very simple to just create a custom interactive and fully functional form in fill out and embed it into your app built with Zite. The editor of Zite also enables you to change the viewport so you can see how your app is viewed in tablet, mobile and desktop mode and edit it accordingly. Beyond this, you also have the ability to create apps for your customers and clients. With Fillout and Zite, you're able to build beautiful customized apps that you and your team and your customers and clients can use straight away without needing technical expertise or bringing a developer in. Zide and Fillout are so powerful together because they fix one of the biggest problems for teams, internal bottlenecks. Having diverse departments and teams means that you can't trust everyone to update the spreadsheets, especially when working with customers or clients. Too often do we find that the spreadsheets become chaotic. Airtable as well. Perhaps you have on-site internal workers that don't truly understand digital tools. Well, instead, create a simple interactive dashboard with forms that allow them to make requests and track their progress. Building your own business app with Zai could never be easier. You would just select it from your fill out dashboard and then prompt it and describe what you want to be built, connecting your database directly to that app. Now this differs from platforms like Airtable and ClickUp that allow you to build interfaces and dashboards because they aren't limited by the things you can include, the widgets and the visualization of your data. Instead, with Zart, you can build fully functional apps just simply by prompting AI, whether that be internal tools, client-facing portals, or even websites. If you want to learn the capabilities of Airtable and building similar apps and interfaces, then make sure to check out the video linked in our description. So if you and your team are looking to build internal tools, business apps, client portals, and more, don't hesitate to reach out to us at automationhelpers.com where our team of experts are offering a free 30 minute consultation. So book yours today.